Hey, this is Amit Kar from IQBix, Green Certified Model of Furniture and Interior System. Today I'm gonna talk about green buildings for a better future. So what are green buildings and why do we need them? Well, green building is the practice of creating structures, buildings, using processes that are environmentally responsible and resource efficient. We can also say that green building design and construction is a method that wisely uses its resources to create homes in commercial buildings which are of higher quality, healthier and they are more energy efficient. Why do we need green buildings? Globally buildings are responsible for a huge share of energy, electricity, water and material consumption. Buildings account for almost 18% of global emissions today which is equivalent of 9 billion tons of carbon dioxide annually. So we need to cut down on these substantially. According to UN Environment Programme, if new technologies in construction are not adopted now, emissions could double by 2050. Green building practices aim to reduce the environmental impact of building. There are several advantages of green buildings over conventional buildings, like they are more environment friendly, they can conserve natural resources which are perishable like water and energy. They generate less waste and pollution and therefore save on operational costs and are healthier. The five principles of a green building which are sustainable site design so that operational costs are lower. They conserve on perishable resources like water, energy. And they conserve and reuse materials and they have better internal environment quality by healthier occupants. For example, Rajiv Gandhi International Airport, Hyderabad has been able to save a huge amount of water just by practicing a few green building practices. How to make our buildings green? By using energy intelligently. Secondly, by conserving water resources. Third, by keeping environment green. Fourth, by minimizing waste and maximizing reviews. And fifth, promoting health and well-being for all. So how do we use energy intelligently? We can reduce inherent energy consumption in the construction of the buildings by using energy efficient raw material with low carbon footprint. This can be done by using materials which are produced near the site. By using recycled material, materials which have got low VOC which is the volatile organic compounds which can impact the ozone layer of the earth and materials with low maintenance and longer life cycle. Icubix makes such products for interiors which have minimum wastage and are made of 100% recycled aluminium. You can also use energy efficiently and intelligently by using more natural daylight for reducing the artificial lighting cost. You can also work on reducing the energy consumption by making environment more green and reducing the heating or the cooling load on the building by green cover on escape as well as the rooftop. We can also use energy intelligently by using alternative sources of energy like wind turbines and solar panels. Now water is a perishable resource and continuously decreasing so we can conserve our water by reducing the run of water by using rainwater harvesting systems and making more permeable landscape which allows the water to permeate in and be stored as a groundwater. You can also reduce the water consumption by using ultra low flush toilets and low flow faucets. Keeping our environment green reduce the need for cooling of buildings in tropical climates. Green landscape also allows water conservation by creating reservoirs. Green cover minimizes heat reflecting back to the buildings and also reduces the pollution levels and improves IAQ, which is the indoor air quality. Minimizing waste and maximizing reuse is, is an important practice by generating less waste and reusing the resources we can load the environment much less. 
so we have to use more durable material which requires less maintenance and replacement and therefore will be generating less waste we can use recycled industrial material we can uh, do composting of the waste which is generated we can improve the iaq that is the indoor air quality and promote health and well-being by increasing the ventilation bringing more fresh air inside by avoiding materials and chemicals that create harmful or toxic emissions and by incorporating more and more natural light and better indoor temperatures now how much a building has been able to achieve its sustainability goals is something which needs to be certified by a third party certification which is called green building certification now most of the countries have their own green building certification authorities and there is a world green building council iqbix products are certified green pro by indian green building council confederation of indian industries to summarize green building combines many practices techniques and skills to reduce the ultimate and ultimately eliminate the impact of buildings on the environment and human health some practices which include are taking advantage of the renewable sources like sunlight and wind energy conserving water using low impact building material available locally and using green certified products reduction of solid waste and pollution and increasing green cover to reduce energy costs now something about acubix and we are into green post certified model of furniture and interior systems our products have been certified green pro by indian green building council confederation of indian industries and we make various products for interiors and buildings like baffle ceilings ceiling tap doors partition and paneling systems floor junction boxes floor boxes raised ways and so many others well this is all for today see you